Alright baby, we're back, and guess who's got a few surprises for ya? I worked on this for a whole two hours yesterday, so I hope you appreciate it. Can we get a little drum roll for the announcement? Thank you, thank you very much. Yeah, that's right, that's good. Almost there, come on, come on. Uh, so yeah, I, um... I changed, I changed up a bit. Do you like it? I like it. I think the kind of Rugrats, you know, Peanuts drawn art style is pretty nice for this. Since it's basically been about a year since I actually made this little icon and that I've been using it this whole time, I decided to, you know, redesign it, make some more poses, give myself a bit more expression, except for, you know, adding an actual face. Don't worry, my head will stay this blank sheet of paper for as long as I can keep it. So, you may be wondering, what on earth are we doing today? Well, I'm not really sure, all I know is that I wanted to make a video kind of just returning to my computer generated self. And also want to celebrate my new computer, which is actually just my old computer getting fixed because, I don't know if you remember, that was kind of a big deal. I <laughs> So we're just gonna have fun. I have some clips from a live stream that I did that I think are pretty funny that I'm gonna add into this video and some other things. So yeah, we're just gonna talk, discuss, and enjoy ourselves. Should I do the thing? I think I should do the thing. Do, 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 do we, do we want to do the thing? I think we want to do the thing. Ready? Do the thing! I'm recording this on a separate day because I got lazy yesterday and just played Pokemon for a long time. Moving on, first thing we have to talk about is my new computer. As I said, it's just my old computer that's actually fixed and a little bit upgraded, but I'm going to show it off for a little bit. The computer has actually been fixed for a while, but I just haven't had the chance to actually get to it and start working with it until just now. And of course, because of my excitement, I decided to record myself pulling it out of the box and getting everything set up. Are you ready for some absolute scraggly daggly buffoonery? Well then, here we go. So the first thing I had to do was get the computer out of the box, and for someone of my stature, that's actually a very difficult thing. You can see I'm just pointing out the Puget Systems logo, they're absolutely great, they're really good at just, you know, giving you good products, and they helped- Oh look, I knocked over the f camera already, I'm already great at this. Me a lot with fixing my computer, so yeah, they're awesome. Shout out to them, they're great. Honestly, I couldn't explain exactly what's happening in this clip, because truly, I don't even know what I was doing, I was just trying to figure out how on earth I could take the box out of the box, which had another box in it, and it was just- it was just all types of chaotic, you know? I'm really trying here. I mean, it's a great packaging method. I just, I'm just not smart. So getting everything like out and fully like in place was, was truly a hassle just because I'm, I'm not smart enough to, to do it correctly. God, I look like an idiot here. Please don't take this as a tutorial, guys. Like I'm, I'm not doing good at this. And I don't even think that's how you say the sentence. Like, look at this. This is just, this is just me struggling with a giant heavy box that costs thousands of dollars, and I'm just, yeah, yeah. This makes sense. Well, hey, look at that. It's entirely unpackaged and looks perfectly fine. We did a good job, guys. I totally didn't break it already. I promise. I swear. Now, with that out of the way, it's time to set up our desk. The room was really messy, so I spent a lot of time trying to just organize where the monitors and stuff would be on the desk. You knocked over the f monitor, you. F idiot so i'm just gonna speed right through this you know we can just get through this right here no need to look at that i do kind of go a bit crazy but you know it's okay my insanity is just breaking at every point during this video anyway so it doesn't really matter okay so now we're finally at the point of hooking everything up together i think i forgot a cord give me a second okay we found the cord we needed so now it's time for the ultra amazing cord plugging in montage -ish thing kind of i do that uh, just run the thing So all this started because I, because one day my computer would not turn on. Like you see this, this little button right here. Like I, I hit the button and, and nothing happens. So, oh Jesus Christ. Now we're back. Both the monitors seem to be working. Everything seems to be plugged in. Let's, let's see what happens. We want to, we want to see, we want to see this light turn on. Ready? Oh, baby. 
Oh. oh my god, my baby's back. The screen is currently set to the recommendation. I don't care about that. It works. It works. There's something wrong with the resolution on the screen. I'm gonna go fix that, but whatever. Um, back to the time lapse. I am really trying all the different types of editing strategies for this video. I just, I, I don't know, I'm just having fun with this one. But yeah, since you're seeing this video, obviously I finished setting up my computer and now I can make stuff again. So to celebrate that, I actually did a quick little live stream here on this YouTube channel. It was fun, I got to show off some of the projects that I was working on before my computer crashed. I mean, you could have been there and joined us, I don't know what you were doing, you know, maybe you have a life or something, but <laughs> I don't, so I just sit here on my computer talking into a microphone. This is an empty room. I do nothing here. It is a void of emptyless souls that I'm screaming to right now. Can anybody hear me? I also had a full layout. I was able to talk to chat and communicate with people and just what was going on. Even had a few moments where we just kind of went completely off topic and just looked up random things on the internet. It was a fun time. Here, I actually have a few clips from the stream that I wanted to show off, so enjoy this little segment of the video. Welcome, welcome. I hope you all enjoy uh, your time here. Hi, YouTube. Oh, fucking. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> and any, any time, always gotta be hit it with the hi, YouTube. If you curse on streams, it hacks your computer and deletes your entire personality. Well, that's good. I never had a personality anyway, so it's perfectly fine. I can fabricate one from watching Mac Does It videos. Good morning, Butterscotch Ed. Honestly, that's a hard name. I, I Butterscotch Ed is such a, is such a name. We're not all mentally sick, some of us are 12. I'm a clean, I'd say I've matured a little bit. I'm a good 14, I think. Like, I'm not, like I'm not making poop jokes as much anymore. That was a whole lie. I completely do make poop jokes still. That was, that, I, I'm such a liar. Yeah, I'm, you know what, you know what, maybe, maybe I'm mentally, maybe I'm not 14, maybe I'm just four. That's fine. Chat will continue doing the um, American Dad theme song as we go. That's gonna be great. This will be a good stress tester. This will actually be good. How did it load that fast? No, I'm d I'm dead serious. Uh, how did it? It did that so quick. It popped in so quickly. Hey, wait, it's doing it's doing this ridiculously fast. Actually, I know I know it looks like it's kind of trudging along, but this is this is this is our boy right here. This is the cyber spider. Oh my god! Wait, it runs. It play. It's playing back in real time. I'm I'm sorry. I know I know. Oh, that's crazy. That's actually insane. This is real time rendering of stylized animation, and I'm streaming, and it's my computer's not even like. Heating up at all. The fans aren't even going that much. He's just he's just a he's just a guy. He's just a guy. Um with a cool spider suit and a cybernetic arm, because he's cool. This is what I mean when I say I don't finish projects. I just see a file, it's called the garden. I have no clue what that means. I open it up, it's a camera and a wall. Oh oh I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Three wall balls. Well, I don't want to. It's not about offending you. It's about offending the, the YouTube gods, the YouTube Susan up there. The Susan with just solo on YouTube. I don't. I don't know. I, I. I think. I think. I think she does. I. I have no clue. Actually, you know what? We're gonna. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this like another. Like an older live stream. Who needs Blender? Where you can look up who owns YouTube. YouTube's an American online video sharing platform. Of course. Just, just tell me who owns it. She's an executive officer of Google. Okay, that makes sense. Wait, 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 wait. I'm, no I'm noticing a thing. CEO of Alphabet and Google. What's Alphabet? Oh, so this is Google's parent company. I thought, I thought Google was the parent company. I didn't realize there was even like a higher up to that. I'm, I don't know why we turned into a business YouTube channel out of nowhere. List of mergers and acquisitions by Alphabet. Purchase of Motorola Mobility. Boston Dynamics, the dudes that make the the weird, like the AI dog things. I, I think, yeah, I think there's more to it. Deja News. No way that's an actual name. What, is, what am I, what am I learning here? I have no clue what's happening. Google acquired Dodgeball. Okay, what 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 is Dodgeball? It's a location-based social networking software provider uh, for mobile devices. Okay, that makes sense. Oh wait, there is a list. I'm stupid. There are so many genius labs. I feel like this is not what capitalism meant when they were like free market. I do I don't think this was the intent. It's so many companies. We just hit 2010. We're at 75 different companies and we just hit 2010. I, I found out what was what was burning. Uh, my father is making beans and apparently he burned them.
Apparently that's that's what's going on. Like my whole thing is just like I do it for the bit and if it's not the bit then damn that sucks. Oh you know what we can do? I'm gonna do an interesting little test. I'm going to open up my anomaly report folder. Was this the file? Let's see if I clicked the right folder. This was one of them. The reason why I made anomaly report honestly I made it because it was easy it was not heavy on computers because what I could do was I could lower my resolution and it would count because it's an analog horror series so everything looks low quality anyway so that's why i originally made this started making like analog horror videos was because it worked well for the computer i had at the time oh my god all the textures are gone <laughs> no <laughs> i forgot all the textures would be miss oh it's all pink oh jesus why is it why is it rendering like that turn on optics boom Oh my god, look how quick that is. Look how quick and sexy that is. Oh, yep, it's also all, it's also all fucked up. You can tell which textures I like worked on in After Effects and made specifically because I spend all my time making random animations about things I don't even fully think out. Yeah, creating people that don't exist. It, it's actually, I'm pretty sure it's a website. I believe it's called This Person Does, yeah, This Person Does Not Exist. Boom. It just generates a person that isn't real. And if you refresh the page, I believe it's a new person. Yup. <laughs> the fun thing is you can see the artifacts in the background. Yeah, it does get some really good details though. Honestly, I could just do this for a while. We, we, not many black people. I could not stress this enough about like AI generation things. It is hard to find black people in these things. Yeah, I mean, hey, no, here's the thing about AI is that it absolutely can be racist because AI at a lot of times is based off its whatever it references. I believe this has actually happened once where you use like chat rooms or social media to like have an AI reference as like a chat bot and then it became incredibly racist. I think that was a thing. Wait, let me, let me make sure I'm not talking about my booty hole here. The thing about AI is that when it references human behavior, it, like it's not going to question like what is right and wrong. It's just going to replicate what it's been told to learn off of. And if that thing is racist behavior, then it's gonna repeat that. It's I guess that I guess that'll be it. I don't really know how to end off a stream or to start one or to do everything in between. I've been Elias of Elias Entertainment and um yeah, ladybugs. To be fair, I also don't know how to end a YouTube video. But I hope you enjoyed the stream clips. I plan on streaming a bit more in the future, at least for the next like month and a half or so, so look forward to that. I also have a lot of videos planned. Now that I have my computer back, I just have so much that I want to do from Anomaly Report to Inside the Mind to even a bunch of little projects like reinventing Donnie the Ladybug as a live action animated thing. It's gonna be fun. I'm not really sure exactly where I'm going with this YouTube channel, but I think everyone's gonna like it and I definitely enjoy what I'm doing right now, so we'll see how it goes. So with that out of the way, I'm Elias of Entertainment. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if my computer breaks again, then I'm definitely committing arson.